But yeah, let's get right into area 14. All right, hopefully it doesn't take too long. We got an ant, we got a zombie brawlo. All right. I like how they're using a lot of zombie brawlos in these behemoth stages. I like the ant. It's been a while, it's been a while since I've seen the ant, actually. It's kind of comforting to see the ant back and just gonna, like, blow everything up with his butt or whatever. Yeah, cat game. Cat game's funny. Oh, no, behemoth gory. I don't want to see a behemoth gory today. I got pizza cat for him, but, like, after what I just did earlier, I don't want to see you again, bro. You pretty much made me have to waste a, a good probably 10 to 15 meter ships and... Three hours of my cat game streaming time to beat the Aku Niandem. Oh, what a way. What a way to go. Oh, look at that. We got the new enemy again. Yay. Little alien piggy that pretty much does nothing except just tank. He's just chilling. Yeah, he dies quick, bro. Is this the whole stage or is there base hit? This is the whole stage. I might just grind this stage instead. The whole previous stage. All right, anything gonna pop out or is that the stage? Okay, looks like the stage. All right. Pretty simple stage. Everything's timed. No boss. No crabby. Kind of missed the crab. I don't know where he is. He's just been kind of like chilling lately. But look at that. We got a rock. All right. Let's get into area 15 here. We got the general lineup. Let's just get right into it. Desert area 15. After this, we got one more behemoth stage on this area. We are pretty much up to date with all the rock stages because we have done all the volcanic stages and forest stages. Okay. Oh, okay. We got boar. Okay. That kind of surprised me a little bit. I don't really have much for the boar except for... Uh, can can here okay we killed the piggy just in time for the boar here which is nice but i don't think this boar should be much of a problem as long as we keep slowing him with can can it looks like we can get like a really good can can stack here because there really isn't any like huge threat of a peon out here except for just the piggy here that's really tanky never mind okay never mind hello there uh Ran Jing kong i think that's his name uh i need mushroom cat for you okay so next time mushroom cat unless we can beat him easily like, we got a carrier stack down, and he's not doing any waves. Okay, now we did a wave. Okay, I think that ruined my stack. Yeah, okay, that ruined everything. We can possibly still kill him. Like, we got a lot of good chip damage on him from him not doing any waves and having, like, a good courier stack. Money is an issue. I don't like the money issue. You know, look at that nasty wave. Oh, yeah, we need Mushroom Cat for this. Okay, we need to... We, we can't beat him without Mushroom Cat or even Octo. Yeah, unfortunate. Oh, man. Okay, I didn't mean to bring Matic much legs out. I hate that. Like, when I scroll my mouse by accident, it accidentally, like, puts out a unit. Like, look, I do it again. Look, look my cursor's right here. Watch this. Okay, it's not doing it now. Like, see? Look at that. You saw that? Okay, let's kill this piggy fast so we don't have to deal with him with the boar. Okay, piggy gone. Nice. Let's all wall a little bit more. Because we're going to need money for years of Minka here once this boar dies. Okay, let's start getting the Octos and uh, Mushroom Cats out. We need them out. Okay, here's a Mika come out too. There we go. There he is. Look at him. He's fast. Fast boy. I have this, like, absolute fear of Pono spamming this enemy in a, U in a ZL stage. Just like they do with normal Angelic Gories. I really hope they don't make a remake of the stage I'm stuck on in Three Crowns, Ruxbury Vortex. But instead, they replace Angelic Gory with this Gory. I hope. Ponos, don't do that. Ponos, don't follow that idea, please. Okay, look at you. some mean Mika doing some good damage, bro. Look at this. She's also weakening, which is also really... Can, we... Can I stop scrolling? Look at that, bro. Yours and Mika shredded the stage. Unfortunately, we weren't able to see it that well because of the freaking stupid scrolling, but Ooh, she shredded the stage. Beautiful. Yours and Mika is such a great unit. Definitely want to use her more often for slaying behemoth enemies, for sure. Absolutely amazing. But look at that. We did it. Mmm, beautiful. Let's get into area 16 here. The final behemoth stage that we really have in these normal rock curling stages. All right, Mr. Angel. How are you doing? Mr. Angel is cool. I see Mr. Angel a lot. Okay, here's a wild doge. Oh, who loves wild doges? I love wild doges. Especially that 251 in my uh, custom stage. That, that's a fun wild doge, isn't it? <laughs> it's a lot of fun. Oh, look, we got, even got the double angels. That's so cool. Ooh, look at the behemoth gory. Oh, big guy. The big guy's out. So, the question is, is this base hit? I think this is base hit, almost. It looks to be base hit. Like, it's not like anything too overwhelming, so... Okay, we're about to be done the base. Let's see what's in here. Ooh, okay, we got the elephant again. Okay, no probs. The elephant isn't that much of a big of a deal, honestly. I've never really had truly any issues with this guy. So far, at least. I feel like he's gonna become an issue in the future sometime, but like right now, he really isn't that much of a menace, which is a good thing. I don't want more enemies being a menace. Like, Loros is bad enough as he is. Loros can piss off. The only really big issue right now is just money, but look at that. Oh, we killed everything. Look at that. We got a lot of good money. I think I kind of can outrange. Let's see if I kind of can do some things here. 
about to say, is Akane dead already? No, she's just kind of behind pizza. What I don't like about layering in this game is that Ubers can be layered like so far behind that you don't even know if they're alive or not. Oh, I don't think that kind of outranges. Oh, she's dead, yeah. Oh, and there's also like a little clean. Oh, there's a little Leonel too. Interesting. I don't think the clean ult should be too much of an issue. Possibly. I don't know, maybe. Because yeah, the elephant takes care of Cleonel's blind spot, and that is a horrible thing. Okay, so this is definitely a next CW grinding because I know for sure I can Fanoa this. This will be so easy with Fanoa to farm. So I'm guessing this is going to be my new rock stage I'll be farming. Keep the cat, keep doing your thing, please. Housewife, level 7 glows. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, there we go. Nice. Let's get Mina out. I, don't, I think Mina's going to get out range, but like, hey, maybe she can do an extra chip. I don't know. Mina. Ooh, look at that. Get a taxi. And I can get the taxi in. She doesn't get outranged. Okay, she outranges. That's nice. Thank god these behemoth curling stages, a lot of them are really easy. I feel thankful for that, actually. I don't want to sit here like 20 hours trying to be a stupid freaking behemoth stage. Oh, Mina's gone. Okay, Wild Doge. Away. Can can. Good job. Dude, I still don't get why with behemoth enemies they have to just put like an un unreasonable amount of health on them. Like, how am I supposed to chip him now? Okay, yeah, Courier can get some hits. I'll just kind of Courier stack here. I'll try. God, look at my courier chip and still alive. Insane. Go away. Thank you. There we go. Oh my god. Definitely gonna Fanoa this uh, when I grind this stage. Oh boy. But there we go. Look at that. We did it. Boom. We're up to date with every behemoth stage in the curling things. Beautiful.